trees all bark. Ha! Ah, get it! Get it! Ow! But of course, good old ginger pubes. Weasley's already waiting here for me. Get back here, Phantom Pants. Ow! What's going on, YouTube universe? This is our God Zero. We are back with more Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Thank you for joining me, as always. Uh, we've got to talk to Ron. Ron. Ready to go to Hogwarts, Harry? I mean, we're running late enough as it is. We better fucking haul our ass. Look. Deploy airbags! Deploy airbags! Shit! Ron! Ron! Where are you? Over here, Harry! The one pit Willow's got me! Don't worry, Ron! I'll come and get you! Just hold on! I can't do anything else! Hurry up, Harry! I'll save you, Ronald McWeasley! Hope you guys appreciated the uh, the first episode. Sorry, there was a week in between where this didn't go down. Been having some. Uh, uh oh. Been having some technical difficulties, but it's okay. We're back on track now, and that's all that matters. Excuse me. Give me all your Bertie Bots, every flavour beans. We want to stockpile all these beans because uh, when we get to Hogwarts and we get to talk to Fred and George, we're going to cash all these beans in for a good time. I don't remember the Whomping Willow being this dangerous. Come on, Harry! I just love how all the bushes have some beans in them. Something more than... Ow! Okay, we can hit them with flipendo or pick up and throw these things. Uh. I'm an idiot. Come on, Howie! Move your ass! I could do with another chocolate frog if I'm being completely honest with you. Um, you fucking branch! No, Harry!
Thank fuck. There are many objects in the world which, when hit with flipendo, will release items that you may need on your adventure. Like these bushes having some Bertie Bots every flavour beans. Uh oh! Piss off! Little jerk off. Little ah. bastard. Get out of here, you vermin! Oh. Ow! Get out of here! I hope to Christ this is a chocolate frog. A wizard's card. There we go. Some health pots. Oh, Hedwig! Hedwig! Students are warned that the area surrounding the Whomping Willow and the Forbidden Forest on which it borders are out of bounds. This is due not in the least to the number of wild guy trashes that roam the forest. If students should find themselves being approached by these giant dog spirits, they are advised that they can be harmed by the light directed from a Lumos spell. Be careful to direct the beam from a distance and not get too close to the creatures. Well, that... yeah, okay. Oh. Yeah, I remember you. Excuse me. You fucking dog bastard. Fuck all you dog. Please be health pots. If I'm casting the spell, it should count. You ran direct- Oh, that's a fucking load of shit. Oh. 
Piss off, you bastard. Yeah, now you want to give me some health pots? Crawl up in here. Mate, these loading screens are the bane of my existence. The PlayStation 2 is my favourite gaming console of all time, but uh, when you come from playing on the PS5, there is little to no loading screens. You go back to playing this. And then you realise 50% of your gaming time was spent on a loading screen? Holy shit! Wig. Oh, you bastard. Oh. Come on, you whomping bastard. My owl has come through for me again. Ow! Trees all bark. Ha! Get it. Get it. Ow. Come get me, bitch. He got me. I'm right here in the middle. Put Ron down! Thanks, Harry. Much appreciated. Oh, it was nothing. Anyway, we better get a move on. We don't want Professor Snape catching us out so late. On, Very good Harry, point. Go. Come on, Howie! Twelve seconds later. The only thing I'm not looking forward to this time is seeing Snape. Let's just hope he's left because he missed out on the defense against the Dark Arts job again. Or he might have been sacked. I mean, everyone hates him. 
Or maybe he's waiting to hear why you two didn't arrive on the Hogwarts Express. Busted! What's his name? We, uh, we were... In my search of the grounds, I noticed that considerable damage seems to have been done to a very valuable Whomping Willow. I will be speaking with Professor McGonagall later. That tree did more damage to us than we... Silence! I would advise you both to make your way immediately to the Gryffindor common room. But Professor Snape, we... Go, and count yourselves lucky. If I should catch either of you out after tonight, I will definitely deduct house points. We want to make sure Gryffindor wins the House Cup too. Come on, Harry. I'll meet you outside the entrance That's hall. part of my mission with this game, because there is a possibility that any other house can win, Dependent on, uh, I'm going to get a little item that's hidden around here. Brilliant. Dependent on the uh, point distribution. <laughs> Got the greenhouses, and obviously. Hagrid's hut is down that way. Get to your common room, Potter. Move on. Ow! Eat shit, Snake. Move of course, good old Ginger Pubes Weasley's already waiting here for me. Get back here, Fanta Pants. Bertie bots every flavour beans. We gotta we gotta make sure. No, nah, nothing out of that one, that's fine. Into the castle we go. Glasses show which house has the greatest number of house points on any day. And as I said, anybody can win. But it's going to be Gryffindor. Let's go to the giant step or the grand staircase. I was going to say the giant staircase. On, Harry. I'm pre up. trying to open the door, Ronald. If it isn't young Potter, how are you? Glad to be back at Hogwarts? Well, I would be, Nick, if Professor Snape hadn't caught me outside. Well, I suppose that rules are there for a reason, although sometimes the reason escapes me. Yes, you shouldn't be up this late, you know. Better get back to the Gryffindor common room before Professor Snape catches you again. Goodbye. Bye, Nick. Okay, let's go to the seventh floor. Okie dokie. First floor, Transfiguration. Second floor, Charms and the Library. With that forbidden section. Third floor is Defense Against the Dark Arts, which we all know is uh, not Professor Snape. Fourth floor, Mystery of Magic. Fifth floor, Non-Magical Studies. Sixth floor, Ancient Runes. Welcome to the seventh floor. Here we go. I can't get into the common room, Harry. She wants the password. Of course I want the password. How am I to know that you two aren't Slytherins disguised as Gryffindors? Because we don't look like gorillas, that's how. There you are. Someone said you'd been expelled for crashing a flying car into the Whomping Willow. Well, we haven't been expelled. Look, just tell us the new password, Hermione. Oh, very well then. It's Wattlebird.
This game would have been a hell of a lot better. Wattle bird. If they had been able to get the actual voice actors to voice their characters. I think that's what makes Evil Dead what we're currently playing right now. Evil Dead Fistful of Boomstick. Makes it so much better when Bruce Campbell voices Ash. Hey, Harry, Fred and George have set up a shop. You can trade all kinds of things with them for spells and really wicked stuff. Wow, I must go and see them. Where are they? Go through that door and through the reading room. There's a portrait on the other side. What's the password? Liberty Gibbet. Oh, and uh, watch out for Percy. He hates being disturbed when he's studying. I'll meet you in the common room later. Okay, let's go. Let's go hang out with Fred and George. We've been collecting these goddamn beans. Might as well put them to work. I don't think there's going to be much we can purchase from them in the in the beginning because I've only got forty odd beans. But obviously, the deeper we get into the game, the more beans we find, the better the items we can unlock. But it's always good to go pay them a visit and see what's on the table. Huh? I must be hearing things. Hey! Liberty Gibbet. Where did he go? Locomotor Mortis! Locomotor Mortis Mortis! You get back to your fucking room, Harry. To the common room, Harry. What was that? Locomotor Mortis! What a load of shit! Get back to the common room, Harry. If I can just keep quiet. Huh? I must be hearing things. Liberty Gibbet. Where did he go? Get on through, Harry. Eat shit, Percy. Ah, Porter. You finally made it then. Heard about the Ford Anglia. Mum's gonna kill Ron when she finds out. I bet it was worth it to see Snape's face when you landed. Um, sort of. Anyway, welcome to our shop, Harry. Yes. Feel free to browse our extensive range of wizard wheezes and magical merchandise. Everything priced at reasonable rates and the only currency universally accepted throughout Hogwarts. Bertie bots every flavour beans. We're sure there's something here you'll like. Okay, what do we got? How much is a pack of stink pellets? 20 Bertie bots every flavour beans. How much is his egg Stroger card? 30 Bertie bots every flavour beans. Is the Alahamora spellbook? 80 Bertie Bots every flavor beans. I'll just collect this one while I'm here, thank you. Non explodable luminous balloons. What do they cost? 20 Bertie Bots every flavour beans. How much is this Wigan Well potion vial? 100 Bertie Bots every flavour beans. How much is a pack of stink pellets? Let's get some stink pellets. Which we can use to basically stun, stun people. Out of all kinds of nasty situations, Harry. How much is this stink pellet bag? 20 Bertie Bots every... Now you can carry more stink pellets, Harry. There we go, purchases have been made. Now one of these... Yep. So let's say one of these stalls holds the secret to, uh... And we need a, we need a new spell to get rid of the goop.
See you, Percy. Okay, Harry. It's been a long day. I'm really tired and I'm off to bed. Hello, Hermione. So, you and Ron actually flew here, Harry. I really don't think that was a good idea. It's a good thing I wasn't asking your opinion, Hermione. Thanks ever so much for finding my file case, Harry. Have a wizard card. Thank you. That was the little case we found when we came in. And because we found ten wizard cards, we had a little bit of a health boost just then. Hello, Ginny. Hello, Harry. I'm so glad I got sorted into Gryffindor like my brothers. I bet you're looking forward to the first Quidditch match of the season, eh, Harry? Can't wait to run rings around those Hufflepuffs. I can't wait to do some Quidditch either. However... Ladies and gentlemen, I think this is the perfect time to end this episode. When we return, our Hogwarts adventures officially begin now that we're here. Hope you guys have been enjoying this. If you have, do myself a favor, hit that like button down below. And if you're new to the channel, I would appreciate it immensely if you used Flipendo and hit that subscribe button. See what I did there? <laughs> you're not going to get any notifications unless you use Lumos on that notification bell. It'll help you see future uploads a little bit better. But that's it from me, guys. I'm out of here. And as always, I will catch you guys next time.